Biology, Biology A students, this is Mr. Goyette with uh, National University Academy. Today we already discussed some of the topics you will find uh, in Unit 5, and I wanted to go over some uh, information that will be helpful for not only your CSTs, but your biology no knowledge in general. Um, and we're going to go over the human gamete, and today to present that, <coughs> are we starting with, we're going to begin with Will Mollison, and Will's going to explain uh, the human gamete for us. Um, human gamete, uh, 23 chromosome, that would equal a haploid cell, and just like in algebra, n equals 23, well, n is a variable, and n is a symbol for uh, one set of chromosomes. Forty-six chromosomes in a diploid. Two n equals forty-six. Fertilization forms the diploid zygote. Great. Um, so there we can see um, the the um, fertilized egg is the outcome of that um, the two haploid cells forming the diploid cells, and we had talked about. Um, cytokinesis and mitosis, you'll want to review that. Um, but go over the human gamete. Uh, in class, we also discussed um, chromosome 21 and the um, <coughs> what's known as trisomy um, 21, uh, which results in um, Down syndrome. Uh, that example um, is on page... Uh, can you flip that for me, Will? I think it's... Uh, Page uh, 222, uh, so, oh, sorry, 122. Thank you, Will. So on page 122, you'll find more on the human gamete. Um, and it, remember to go over our Unit 5 topics, um, the homologous chromosomes, mitosis, um, sexual reproduction, um, anaphase, telophase, metaphase, and the difference between mitosis and meiosis, which is one of your the charts you have to fill out. So I'd like to thank uh, William and um, Christian for um, helping me out with the presentation and say goodbye, guys. Bye.